Hello and welcome to another tutorial from VideoEditingSoftwareGuide.com. Today we're going to do a effect in CyberLink PowerDirector 8 Ultra, and we're going to be doing dual picture in picture. So you see this on a lot of uh, TV shows or on the news. Sometimes you'll see a background and you'll see uh, two shots of individuals or uh, individual and scenery and two picture in pictures on the screen. So the few things that you got to do to get this set up. First thing that you got to do in CyberLink is make sure that you have enough picture in picture tracks available to you. So you click on the add picture in picture and as you can see I have the one that is automatically on there and I added two more. So you only really need to add one more unless you're going to do a watermark which I'm going to do later to uh, kind of protect my videos on YouTube. So after you get that done what you want to do is you want to go ahead and start putting your tracks in. So the first one you want is your background track. So as you can see on this one I used the uh, roulette wheel here so I'll drop that in. And then you want to choose some other uh, files that you have on here. You might have a file of um, you doing something on one and you doing something on the other one. However you're going to go about doing it you want to go ahead and pull your files down. So next thing I want to do is pull another video file into the picture in picture track here. And as you can see where it went right into the middle of the screen. So the first thing I want to do is move it into a position where I want it. And I try to keep it right in the middle. And there. So next thing I want to do is bring my next track down. So I'll pull it into the next picture and picture track. There. And so you'll see it come up once again on the middle of the screen. So I want to match it up to the location of the other one, but I want it to be about the same distance from the edge of the screen. It's about right there. And so now you can see I got my two video clips and I got the one in the background. So what I also want to do is I want to get them matched up in length because this will just be one part of your video. So of course you don't want them to be different length because if you do this one will stop then you'll only have the this one because it goes out longer and then you'll have this one with it and then this one will stop and then you only have this one. So you want them all to be the same length. So in order to get them to the same length, I'm going to split the clips and I'm going to remove what's left over on the back. Now you're good to go. So you're done. Now you got your clip set up, you got everything going. When you go ahead and play the movie, you'll see that you have the two picture in picture playing on top of the video image in the background. So you're all set. Thanks for watching and we hope to see you again soon.